DJ, you go crazy. Now, Dot, I want to get into some questions the fans got for you. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Uh, like I said, we just recently hit 10,000 subscribers yesterday. You know, I like to engage with the little fan base I got. You know what I mean? Congratulations to them, bro. Thanks, bro. Thanks, sure. bro. So, uh, so these next few questions are coming from the fans. You know what I mean? They say, ask him why OTF or GBE never co-signed him. And when Dirk came to 600, why did he help LA and Rondo but not help? Good question. I never got co-signed, I don't know. That was, that's a good question. But as far as co-signing, I feel like I ain't never need that shit. I wasn't ever looking for that shit, reaching for that shit. And shit, we did fuck with Dirk. You know, we had a little situation. I dropped some shit with Dirk a little minute ago. Dirk had got locked up. We put money on his lawyer, all type of shit. He was supposed to come home and, you know, reach. Came home, he ain't no reach. He was fucking with LA and Nine on some. Coming through the hood and shit, he had a select few who he fuck with on the six. He ain't fuck with the whole 600 because he been fuck with all of us. He weren't really fuck. Him and Ide had some other shit going on too. You know, bro posted sign with you. I was always locked with Ide. That's the only reason I was, you know, in that little mix anyway. That one that one really want my crowd. I was always doing my own shit. I had the 45 shit going on anyway. But yeah, like bro was fucking with Nine in LA, but I was fucking with Nine in LA, so it was like it was an attachment anyway. It went all the way around that to my boys. So we had a connection and shit, but it's like, you know, Nine nah, got booked, LA died. Shit. You know how that went. Mm -hmm. But shit, as far as Sosa shit, I don't know what Sosa, so, so ain't that one. I ain't, I just hollered at Sosa not too long ago, but before that, I wasn't even hollering at Sosa for a long time. I got on his ass, like, bro, don't do that shit, you know? You gotta fuck with niggas who was fucking with you through the door. We was saying shit. I got on his ass, shit over. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know what's going on. Shit. I'm gonna end up fucking with him. We're gonna put something together. Yeah. That's my boy. That's who I grew up with, though. So, you know, that's my homie for sure. For sure, for sure. Uh, but another good question they have for you is uh, your relationship with Lil Reese. Or King Von and ask him if he know FBG Butter, because Butter said he used to live on 59th. I don't know Butter. But shit, Reese cool. Von cool. I knew Von for sure. I used to see Von. I was, me and Tay was cool, you know. Tay said something, he was real close when he stayed like by the hood and shit. Von always over his crib and shit. He used to fuck with his sister. He used to fuck with me in the red and shit, so I'm always at take crib, folks are always over there and shit. So we got a little bond and shit. Yeah, just came home. So shit. Matter of fact, nah, he ain't just had came home, it's before you went in. Yeah. Me and him was bond and shit. A couple times I'd kick it with him and shit. But you know, after bro took off, I don't know. And wasn't no communication. I just was standing behind what he had going on. I like that shit, cause I just watched him do that shit. Come home and go crazy. For sure, for sure. It's all love, though. You know, I fuck with the old, I'm my boys. For I sure. grew up with like the real Parkway members, like niggas who dead and gone, like Jake Money, you know? They're my boys. For sure, for sure. And soon for yourself, man, you know, with you being a, um, you know, a lesser known artist, you know, compared to your brother, Donna Rocha, you know, uh, what's your mindset in terms of, you know, building your brand and building your name, you know, so they know we, we, we like Shaq and Kobe in this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Shit, I ain't gonna lie, shit, I'm just like, right now, I'm just finna go crazy, like, shit, but shit, I feel like, shit, where I'm from, like, Ada Park, like, I feel like the music used to go, like, from the low end and travel to the hundreds, you see what I'm saying? So it was like, shit, it's kind of, like, hard from the hundreds to music to stretch to the low end. But now, you know what I'm saying, like, I feel like it's a change coming, because they seeing me more. Yeah, Y'all gonna see a lot of me, you feel me, like, it's a lot of shit, you know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know about me and Mark. Yeah, hey, the part like Vaughn, like, I, you know, you already know you was his DJ, so it's like shit. You know, it's daddy from Ada Park. Like, Vaughn, I used to be around Vaughn, shorty, you feel me? Like, he used to be in Ada Park, you feel me? Um, bro, like, shit, it's a lot of motherfuckers from my end, man, you know what I'm saying? That shit. We always been let Ada Park, man, you feel me? That shit got put on the That's map. That's another thing, I ain't gonna lie, like, Vaughn, his, 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 his pops from Ada Park, you feel me? In the midst of all that shit was going on. When Shorty signed with T.O., you know, Vaughn was trying to, you know, keep that shit, some of that shit, just off strength. Uh, you know, that's his pops hood and shit. He hearing about what's going on. He was, you know, so it's all love. I fuck with Shorty. Vaughn a real nigga, man. Like, he, you know, he, he really, like, 
You know what I'm saying? I put money on even some of my guys' books. You feel me? That's locked up and shit. You know, it's just so crazy. Just, just like his pops. Like you know, his pops made sure like niggas was straight. Like he'll take care of my fucker before himself. So shit, they was just alike. Like you know what I'm saying? So that's why shit cut or go down like that. That shit like hit different. You know what I'm saying? So like, you know, you gotta learn. There's gonna be fans in this shit though. You know what I'm saying? So like, you know, I hope y'all my niggas, man. Move, move, whole game, man. Oh, yeah, damn. Like, it's a lot of niggas, you know? Yeah. So we took a lot of losses. We trying to get some W's, you hear me? For sure, for sure. DJ, you go crazy!